I wonder if we should finally leave Markarth. These dragon attacks. I think Skyrim is cursed. <laughs> what kind of talk is this? The man I married would never speak of leaving his home. I just don't know if I can keep you safe. We will keep each other safe, no matter what. <laughs> Alright guys, welcome back to the next episode of our Skyrim Let's Play. You join me here in Markarth, of all places, where we were given the note quite a while ago. And I think it's about time that we read it. So let me go down to books. And we need to read Eltree's note. Meet me at the Shrine of Talos. Okay. So we are going to start the Forsworn Conspiracy. So I need to make my way up Red to the Shrine. Every piece. And we will get this thing started. It's been quite a while since we... Uh, Receive this. Do I need to the Emperor mark of Skyrim, it? Dead. Ah, These here we go. Times. It is definitely what dark is times. Dragons? No, not dragons. Let me uh, mark that. There we go. Oh, dude. I'm sorry to drag you into Markarth's problems, but after that attack in the market, I'm running out of time. You're an outsider. You're dangerous looking. You'll do. I'll do? What are you talking about? You want answers? Well, so do I. So does everyone in the city. A man goes crazy in the market. Everyone knows he's a forsworn agent. Guards do nothing. Nothing but clean up the mess. And you want me to find out why? This has been going on for years. And all I've been able to find is murder and blood. I need help. Please, you find out why that woman was attacked, who's behind Waylon and the Forsworn, and I'll pay you for any information you bring me. All right, well, what do you know about Margaret? She's not from Markarth. The air about her screamed outsider. Visitors to the city usually stay at the Silver Blood Inn. Who was Waylon and where did he live? He was one of the smelter workers. I used to have a job down there myself, casting silver ingots. I never knew much about Whalen, except he lives in the Warrens, like all the other workers. And who are the Forsworn? They're remnants of the old rulers of Markarth, natives of the Reach, followers of the old ways. The Nords drove them out of the city, Ulfric Stormcloak and his men. That was about 20 years ago. But somehow they're still here, and they're killing people. You've looked into these murders. Yes. It all started when I was a boy. My father owned one of the mines. Rare for anyone who isn't a Nord. He was killed. Guards said it was just a madman, but everyone knew the murderer was a member of the Forsworn. I've been trying to find out why ever since. Gotten nowhere so far. And then I got married. I have a child of my own on the way. I swore I was going to just give up for my child's sake, but it's like... My father's ghost is haunting me, asking me why. Okay. Keep your eyes and ears open. Okay, well, we can Looks do that. Like you weren't followed. Good. Well, let's do that just in case. Is there anything in here? I don't think there is. I don't ever remember there being anything. I think pretty much this is about the only time we have to look around in here. Can I help you? The Warrens, huh? Well, let's look around. Can we talk to any War of you? The Warrens isn't a place for your type. What do you want? What are the Warrens? It's where you go when you can't afford a room anywhere else. About the time they open the mines, Someone got the idea to throw beds in here. Laborers, the sick, the lame, we're all here. So only the poor or the sick live here? That's right. Welcome to Markarth, Traveler. 
Thank the divines you can choose to live somewhere else. Well, we've worked hard to be able to live somewhere else. And did you know Waylon? Oh, yes. I know everyone who sleeps in the Warrens. Kind of the one who passes the keys around. I guess someone else will be taking his room now. Can I have the key to his room? Sorry, but you don't exactly belong here. Uh, you know, it's important, so trust me. Trust is hard to come by here. But all right. Thank you. Uh-huh. So I believe he's towards the end. Who are you? You don't want to be here. No one wants to. Okay. not his room. There we go. His note. You've been chosen to strike fear in the heart of the Nords. Go to the market tomorrow. You will know what to do in. Ooh. Well, who's in? I suppose we need to go find out, huh? So probably not going to find any information out around here. Hmm. Alright, well, thank you very much for the key. I appreciate it. And we are out of here. Oh, well, who are you and what do you want? You've been digging around where you don't belong. It's time you learned a lesson. Oh, well, who sent you? Someone who doesn't like you asking questions. Come on, let's see what you're made of. I'll get you. Oh, jeez. Yeah, you gotta stay back. Takes forever. Are we good now? You good? Uh, you mangy piece of pit bait. Who taught you to talk or I'll send you to the gods. I was sent by Nepos the Nose. The old man hands out the orders. He told me to make sure you didn't get in the way. That's all I know, I swear. Alright, thank you. Good gravy. We all good here, guys? Uh, let me see. Let me get out of here. Can't talk. Alish will beat me if I stop working. I won't talk to you then. Goodness gravy. So let's go up here and find Nepos the Nose and see what we can get him to spill his guts about. I think he's somewhere. How did I get up here? I don't need the guard tower. Uh, I think I need to go... Nope, over this way. And I believe... He is up. Right? I'm gonna be a silversmith one day, like my mother and father. Oh, nice. Very nice little girl. What quest do we have active? Do we have another one? No, we don't. I don't think he's up any higher, is he? I think this is, uh... Oh, no, I guess he is. Strange. Alright, in we go. Alright, lady. Excuse me, what's your business here? I'm here to see Nepos. We haven't been expecting you and the old man needs his rest. Come back some other time. Wait, it's okay, my dear. Send her in. Thank you. Yes, Nepos. Oh, wait a minute. 
I better do a thing first, just in case. Uh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's good. You heard him. Go on in. I'm sorry about my housekeeper. She's a little protective of me. Now, what is it you want? Why did you send that thug after me? Ah, yes. You've proven to be a real bloodhound. Well, you've sniffed me out. I've been playing this game for almost 20 years. Sending the young to their deaths. All in the name of the Force Woman. And I'm tired. So tired. Why? Because my king told me to. Madanok. When the uprising fell at the hands of the Nords, they threw him in the mines. I don't know how, but he lives. I get his messages, and I hand out his orders without question. Why are you telling me all this? My dear girl, what makes you think you're getting out of here alive? You were seen coming in. The girl at the door is a forsworn agent masquerading as a maid. You aren't the first one to have gotten this far. You won't be the last. Who's Madnock? He is the king in rags. A man who once held all the reach within his grip. He stokes the passions of the downtrodden in this city. Directs them to kill the enemies of the Forsworn in our name. All from inside Sidna Mine. A Nord prison. The irony is quite thick. And you mentioned an uprising. Mark Earth and the Reach are our lands. That is why we are the Forsworn. We cannot claim the home that is rightly ours. But then, during their war with the Elves, we had our moment. We drove the Nords out of the Reach in a great uprising. Then Ulfric and his men came. Those of us who didn't run were executed, except for myself, my king, and a handful of others. Okay. Thought I... Wait a minute. It's something. Is that it? I think that's good. I mean, the guy could have just let us go. There was no need to get all uppy and everything. Give me his journal. Uh, Guilt-ridden, so many young sent to their death. All that violence hasn't overshadowed our Destinies. What choice do I have to do as I'm instructed? Alright, well, we'll take that. Oh, uh, sure. Alright, uh, I think we've taken care of everyone here. I don't remember there being all that much. Maybe a little bit of gold laying around. I don't think I need that. Don't see anything here that I really desperately need. We'll take all that. Third era timeline. I don't know that I've picked that one up before. I think we're good. Oh, is that a soul gem? Thank you. I probably won't get any of this back. I don't know why I'm bothering to pick it up. But, you know, I do have a tiny bit of a loot problem. I have so much stuff stashed away, it's not even funny anymore. Oh, I'll take that wheat. Thank you. I think... We are good to get out of here now. Do you not think there's anything else we need? Alright. Come on in. 
The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Maybe you can tell me about Margaret? This is the Silverblood Inn. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. Did a woman named Margaret stay here? Ah, yes. Rented the nicest room we had for a whole month. Best we all forget about her. Bad luck to talk about the dead in Markarth. Okay. Remember, ale is cheaper than blood in Markarth. Mm, okay, thank you. So her room is up here, but I know I'm pretty sure. I know I'm pretty sure, yeah, that made a whole bunch of sense. That I picked up her book before. Oh, no, I guess I didn't. All right, there we go. General Talius is growing impatient, but I'll bring back the deed to sit in mine on my life. I won't allow a group of Stormcliff sympathizers to own the prison. Oh, okay. Something about the treasury house. So I suppose we need to go there next. All right, well, I'll meet you guys over there. You, I've seen you snooping around, asking questions. Back off. You don't want to know what happens to troublemakers here. I'm not trying to cause trouble. You're finding it. That's bad enough. This is your last warning, outsider. We keep the peace here. Stay out of our business. You got this thing with your leg. You may want to go and have that checked out. Weird. Alright, let's go to the treasury house and see what we can find. Although it's probably not good of us to uh, keep snooping around. Bad things always happen when I get snoopy. Looks like I need to go up this way. Hello. What are you doing here? I told them no visitors. Oh, I'm sorry, but I'm here about Margaret. The Imperial agent. That's right, I knew. How many dogs is the Empire going to send after me? This is my business. My city. You Empire lovers should learn to stay out of it. Now get out! What? By the gods! That's... Who's? I can't tell who's. Must have my wife. They killed her. Damn Madanok. Damn his forsworn backside. I'm sorry. No, you're not. You want to know what the forsworn really are? They're my puppets. I have their king rotting in Sidna mine. He was supposed to keep them under control. You made a deal with the Forsworn. When their uprising was crushed, I had Madanak brought to me. He was a wild animal, but a useful one. I offered him a stay from execution if he used his influence to deal with any annoyances that came up. Competitors, agents, idiots. So I've let him run his little Forsworn rebellion from inside Sidna mine. Now he's out of control. You want me to take care of Madnock? You already got what you wanted, you damn hound. This is your fault. You and Madanak are animals, and I'll see you both rot to death in Sidna mine for this. Now get out of my house. Dude, I can still have you killed. And I'm not done anyways. that everybody? Alright, get in. Uh, 
I want to look in your room, sir. Anything good in here? Ah, yes, there is. Don't need anything from the end table. Ah, this is what I need, though, right here. Very nice. That gives us 19 of them. All right, dude. I'm out. I will leave your home. Oh, Ooh, wait a minute. Thank you. Uh, sorry about the mess. All right, we are out, and we need to return to the Shrine of Talos. All right, let's talk to Ultras, and it doesn't look like we're going to be. But you had to just go and cause trouble. Now we have to pin all these recent murders on you. Silence witnesses. Work, work, work. Oh, corruption is hard, isn't it? What did you do to Altrus? Same thing we do with all the other natives who want to change things around here. We had a nice little deal going between Thonar and Madanak until you and Elthris started snooping around. Well, you wanted to find the man responsible for those killings. You'll have plenty of time with the king in rags when you're in Sidna Mine. Oh, fine. I'll come quietly. You'll never see the sun again, you hear me? No one escapes Sidna Mine. We'll see about that. No one. A personal belongings chest somewhere in the jail. Yeah, whatever. All right, prisoner. Eyes front. You're in Sidna Mine now, and we expect you to earn your keep. There's no rest in your hide in a cell in this prison. Here you work. You'll mine ore until you start throwing up silver bars. You got it? Got it. Good. All right. Open her up. Now you, get down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I have spells, right? Hmm. All right, let's see. Uh, I think I need to speak with you. The new meat. So soft, tender. What was it like killing your first one, huh? Ah. Uh, Jeez, I'm not a murderer. Liar. What are you in here for? Murder. Banditry, assault, theft, and lollygagging. How long have you been here? Guards brought me in about 12 years ago. Was running a good group of bandits up until then. But these Forsworn, they're nothing like the men I cobbled together. They're real killers. Good to know. All right, then. Who are you? What are you in for, new blood? God, nothing, I'm innocent. Innocent? So was I, for the first one. The other murders were all me, though. My advice? Serve your time at the pickaxe and get out. You don't want to end up getting a shiv in the guts over a bottle of skooma. Where's Madnock? If you're asking, that means you're the new lifer. Tough luck, friend. Those guards sold you out, but good. No one talks to Madnock, I'm afraid. Not without getting past Borkle the Beast. And you don't want to talk to Borkle the Beast. Borkle the Beast? Madinok's guard. Big, even for an orc. Heard he ripped a man's arm off and beat him to death with it. He's old-fashioned like that. Uh, what's a chef? Small blade. Easy to hide. I mean, sure, you could just swing a pickaxe into someone's face, but... People tend to see that coming. Got a problem with a prisoner? Get a shiv. Here Grisvar has a spare, if you could get him to part with it. What are you in for? A Nord nobleman I served was stabbed in the night. Wasn't me, but I knew I'd be blamed. So I ran, joined the Forsworn, started killing, got caught. Now I'm here. 
why did you join the Forsworn? Because life was better under the old ways. No Nords and their laws. One day the Forsworn will paint the walls of Markarth in their blood. Where are the guards? They come in here once a week to clean out the bodies, grab any ore we've mined, and beat down the troublemakers. That's the only time when we get food, too. And if there's not enough ore mined up, we don't get any. Good to know. Now, if you'll excuse me. Absolutely. All right, well, I'm... Who are you? Yarl decided I, I got locked up one too many times. Now I'm in for life. I need a shiv. Ah, you want protection? I can get you what you need. Maybe you could do something for me first. Duok has a bottle of skooma, finest distilled moon sugar. I'm shaking just thinking about it. Sure, I'll get it for you. Thank you, friend. Don't worry. I'll have that shiv ready for you. Cool. What are you in for? The first time, thieving. The second time, thieving. The third time, thieving. It kind of keeps going like that. Not a very good thief, for you? Until next time. And who are you? I was sent here because someone said I was a Forsworn. What are you in for? Guards say I murdered someone. I was just sleeping off some meat in my aunt's house. That didn't stop them from arresting me. I don't even know who they said I killed. How long have you been here? A couple of years. I wasn't a Forsworn when I came, but I joined up when I got in. Easier that way. Hmm. Good to know. Farewell. Who are I you? Swear, oh, all right. I ever get out of here. I'm giving up thieving. Really. Oh wow. Don't reach for a shiv around me or we'll both regret it. What are you in for? I don't want to talk about it. How long have you been here? Long enough. Till next time. What do you want? Hmm. I'm digging to do. Yeah, I see that. I would like to I'm have all innocent. the silver, though. The north. Yarrow decided I was too much of a problem. Threw me in here. Force me. Alright, let's run over here. Grab that thing of schema in a minute. Alright. Let's see. I think he's over this way. Are you who I'm looking for? Yes. Other prisoners get suspicious when we talk to each other, so keep it down. But I hear you have some skooma. You give me one more look, and I cut you open. That skooma's mine. But I need some really badly. Getting the shakes, huh? All right. Take it. Old gods keep you. Thank you. See you. Anyone else here? No. Huh. I think I've been able to actually mine all this out of here at one time or another. Isn't there one here? Yeah. Alright, let's go see if we can get what we need. Uh, who, oh, with this guy in here. Now, I don't actually plan on using this ship. I just want it for our collection. Ooh. Hmm, yeah, okay. I was sent here because someone said I was a Forsworn. Oh, you're not the who I want. Until next time. You are. I have your schema. Here's your shiv. Promise you won't ever use it on me, okay? Sure. I promise I won't. Thank you. Uh -huh. All right. Let's go and talk to this guy. Yep, we're good. I left All right, behind dude. my daughter. Who I you serve your me. time by digging, so dig. No, I see. Need to see Mad Knock. You want to talk to the king in rags? Fine. But first you gotta pay the toll. How about you get me a shiv? Not that I need one, but it's nice to have one in case I need to do some shaving. <laughs> Madnock is expecting me. <sighs> Fine. Go on in. But don't try anything in there. Madnock knows more than you think. Thank you. Fight well. And I get to keep the shiv. Haha. -ha. 
Alright, let's get in here and talk to him. I don't think there's much back here. Yeah, just an evil bucket. Alright, Madnock, what do you got? Well, well, look at you. The Nords have turned you into an animal. A wild beast caged up and left to go mad. So, my fellow beast, what do you want? Answers about the Forsworn? Revenge for trying to have you killed? No. I want my freedom. Your freedom? Yes. But even if you were to escape Sidna Mine, your name would still be stained with all that blood. You're one of us now, you see? A slave. The boot of the Nord stepping on your throat. Maybe if you understood that, I could help you. Understand how? There's a man named Bregg inside these mines. Besides me, he's been here the longest. Tell him I sent you. Ask him why he's here. I want you to know how widespread the injustice of Markarth is. Sure, but I want to know about Thornar. I had Markarth. My men and I drove the Nords out. We had won. So we thought. Retribution was swift. I was captured, quickly tried, and sentenced to death. But my execution never came. Thonar's Silverblood stopped it. He wanted the Forsworn at his call, that I would point their rage at his enemies and spare his allies. And I have. Humiliating at first, but I knew he would let his guard down eventually, that he would come to trust I was under control. Alright, uh, I have some questions about the Forsworn. This was our land. We were here first. Then the Nords came and put chains on us, forbid us from worshipping our gods. Some of us refused to bow. We knew the old ways would lead us back to having a kingdom of our own. That is who we are. The Forsworn. Criminals in our own lands, and we will cut a bloody hole into the Reach until we are free. Remember, it was the Nords who locked you up. Okay. Whoa. Wild shovel. Alright, let's go back and you serve your find time the by guy digging. So dig. Who we need to speak to. I think it's this guy all the way back here. I think, yeah, you. Don't reach for a shiv around me or we'll both regret it. Uh, Madnock asked me to hear your story. My story, huh? Everyone in Sidna Mine has a tale. Let's hear yours first. When was the first time you felt chains around your wrists? Uh, I was in Hogan. I was being sent to the Executioner. Uh, so you know what it's like to have your life in someone else's hands. Why should they get to decide? Isn't judgment for the gods? Do you have any family? Anyone waiting for you on the outside? I have friends. It's the only family I need. I had a daughter once. She'd be 23 this year. Married to some hot-headed silver worker, or maybe on her own, learning the herb trade. The Nords didn't care who was and who wasn't involved in the Forsworn Uprising. I had spoken to Modernak once. That was enough. But my little Aethra didn't want to see her papa leave her. She pleaded to the Jarl to take her instead. And after they made me watch as her head rolled off the block, they threw me in here anyway to dig up their silver. I'm sorry to hear what, to hear what happened to you and yours. My daughter is the one who needs your pity. I'm just a poor Forsworn whose only regret is not killing more Nords before I was locked up. All right. All right, then. Don't reach for a shiv around me or we'll both regret it.
I don't know. I feel bad for him. It seems typical of some of the Nords. Of course, it kind of seems typical of the Salmer, too. Alright, what does he have to say now? I did his little thing. You're back! Have you done what I asked? I did. Yeah, imagine hearing a story like that over and over. Each time a different family, each time a different injustice. Your meddling above ground reminded me of how removed I've been from the struggle. My men and I should be in the hills, fighting. So, you'll help me escape then? Yes, but I need a show of loyalty from you. I don't need a shiv in the back while we break out. Have you met Grisvar the Unlucky? He's rightly named, and he's also a thief and a snitch. He's outlived his minor usefulness. Take care of him, and then we can leave Sidna Mine for good. Our struggle is our people's struggle. If I just kill Badnock, can I just get the key to get out of here? Behind my daughter, Uale, when I was taken. I don't know if I can or not. Get who I need to get. You? No. Get you? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, it is Brilliant. you. What? <gasps> I had nothing to do with it. Thank you. I wanted the shows. <laughs> I I did his dirty deed. Ah, oh, I don't know. I'm really tempted to kill this man. Do you remember the sun? Because you'll forget soon. All right. Well, he's dead. You finally become one of us. Come with me. I think it's time I announced my plans to you and your new brothers. Sure. Go ahead. Not what I want. What's going on, Madeline? You wouldn't have old Grisbrock killed unless you weren't planning on needing him. My brothers, we have been here long enough. It's time to leave Sidna Mine and continue our fight against the Nords. Through this gate, just beside my quarters, is a tunnel. A tunnel that leads right through the old dwarven ruins of Marka, into the city. Well, what do you say, my brothers? The reach belongs to the Force Sworn! I say you've earned an early pardon. Let's go. I'm ready. Into the tunnel. Let's go. All right, go get it open. Tunnels over there. There we go. Sure. All right, guys, we're out of here. We're gonna be free, and they're gonna forget about us as long as we don't go back into the Temple of Talos, right? Because if we do, we will be arrested, or actually we'll be not arrested, we will be murdered on sight. Anything here? I don't think there's much to grab on the way out. At least I don't remember there being much. This is where we uh, came in and killed the spider and then went down and did... Um, here we go! Uh, That little quest for Calcimo. Must have scared him off. 
Oh, maybe. What was that? I think you got another one coming in. I knew it. Here we go. Who took care of that, dude? I think I took care of it. Oh, here we go. I think we're good to leave, aren't we? Oh, hey, dude. Oh, jeez. I don't want to hit this guy behind. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, which way are we going down? Alright, thank you. Ah, this way. Good work. Get ready while I have a word with our favorite outsider. I had Kai recover all the things the Nords stole from you. You better get ready before we break out into the city. And take this. It's blessed with the old magics. Something to remember me by. Uh, what happens now? Now? I announced to all of Markarth that I have returned. Don't worry about your name. They'll know who to blame and fear after today. It'll take years, but I'll organize the Forsworn again. We'll reclaim our land, and then when power is ours, we'll have peace. A kingdom. Until then, let me offer you a warning. Beware the Forsworn. No place in the Reach is safe from us now. Okay. Beware the Forsworn. Uh, I don't really think I'm all that worried about you right now. Maybe if you cause this uprising that you think you're going to. You going out, dude? Madonna, think you can escape my prison, do you? You'll pay for what you've done to my family. Your family? You've poisoned the Reach with your tainted silver for long enough, Thonar! Here we go! That's all you got? That did kill you! That's a great I'm just gonna let them take care of it. I don't need to get myself in any more trouble than what I'm already in. Come on, you guys, you can do it. Dude, I think you're gonna die. Ha, found you. Ah. Ah, I'm just gonna let them take care of each other. No need in us getting in any more trouble than what we're already in. I'm just gonna pick up and loot all the dead bodies of their arrows because that's about all the guards have really on them hey dude did you kill the guy you were looking for actually i wouldn't mind a markarth shield here we go everybody else dead um sure Ah, this must, this was Sornar. Uh, this little Shadow Rebellion of his better not start to include me, though. If I find out he's even thinking about double-crossing me, I'll make sure he dies inside the Sidna Mine like the animal he is. Oh, how'd that work out for you, dude? Not very dang well. Alright guys, well, I think we've done, I don't know, necessarily a good thing, but we did do a thing. So, I think with all that, 
we're going to leave it here for today. So thank you so very much for joining me today. I've been Ball Girl. Hope you guys have enjoyed. And I hope I see you in the next one.